Hello TV, Mr. Jörg. Yes, hello. <laughs> we are here with the master of disaster, Eric Birdie Lawrence. And he's presenting his uh, his awesomeness bar tools. Kind and of, he yeah. just he just told me a very cool story about your jigger. So we got one little jigger here which uh, was born in a way that I work with uh, measures of 10, 20, 30, uh, 15, 45 and 60 ml. Me as well. So it's two of us on the road. Yeah. yeah. And to have this, I always had to have three jiggers at least. We have all these measures able to use. Yeah. And then I was like, why don't we have it in one go, in one jigger? To have it in one jigger, you just break it down to 10, 20, 30, 15, 30, 45 and 60. And now comes the new part. Now comes the other part. If you wanna, you, if you finish with a 10 part, and you wanna flip it up with a 15 part, and you fill up this one and start dripping. So you have all that dripping. You have to come up with something which uh, lets all your liquid go out from your jigger. So, so this, this is still is in progress. Yeah. Still in progress because you work with the various liquids yeah. of uh, thickness of the sugar. So spirit-wise. So which means like a pen, there will be if you turn around, there will be no drops. That's the aim. A spirits and a fortified wines are there, and then we make sure that even it sounds the agar a little bit like a thing from Mr. Q. <laughs> you know, So what else we have? What else we have here? <laughs> so, I'm a martini drinker. I'm a traveler, and I oh, don't like. Oh, we have like... a date for a martini in New York. That's right. We have a date in the New York bar. <laughs> yes. And I broke so many mixing glasses on my travels. Yeah. I have the same. No anymore. Because in this fabulous can thing. I, well, how much is it? I buy one. I can buy it. Good price. Good price. Good price. I like that. I like that. Cool. Uh, so we got a mixing tin, which is uh, again polished. We love polishing because it's all manufactured in Japan. Yeah. And we love everything to be nice and polished. Yeah. So it's fine polished from inside. Right. With a perfect strainer. So you got a strainer, of course, once you have the mixing glass, you want to have a strainer as well, which helps you to strain and help you to separate your eggs, you also as well, from the egg whites, if you work in the various things. It's Mr. Q again, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> then we have the shaker. And then we have a spoon oh, as well. Oh, Let's go to the spoon. Oh, oh, oh. Let's go to a little spoon there. What's, what's this? Carving or what's So this, this is a 30 ml, 30 centimeter spoon, perfectly fit in. For traveling and also helps you balance it out because I ask many bartenders myself, you got a fork there, how many times do you use the fork when you spoon? Never. Thank never. You. Me either. I, I never use I use it with a fork. I, I use it only once when it stabbed myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you get rid of the fork and use something which once you want to separate your strainer for from a gin and tonic, yeah. lift the ice, floats, something probably more useful and balance out the spoon as well. Nice. Nice, I like that. And then we have the so barmaid. Leo's jealous already, he wants one. Oh, for me? No, 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 for yeah. You can buy the whole head cocktail here. Ta da! By circumstance. It's not good because it's like gold. Nice. Don't do that. So then we have a shaker as well. And then we have a birdie shaker. Why it's called birdie? Uh, do you play golf? No. Ah, I got it. One of the perfect shots in a golf. Yeah. It's called the birdie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we're talking about the perfect bar tools. Here so we why go. Why don't you call them birdie? Here we go. And then we have a, a fabulous birdie shaker. I saw it's a little bit different like pieces. the Japanese from the... Uh, it's Japanese too. Yeah, but the, the shape is different. Very correct. Because what do you want to do when you shake your hand you're shaking? To rotate the ice. Aeration. And if you have the shoulder, you won't rotate. Ah. You just start breaking down. Here, you create a perfect rotation and perfect frame. Yeah. Awesome. Feet to hand. So, ladies and gentlemen, watch out for. We will have soon in a, in a two finishes. So this one is called the mezcal finish, and that's what it's called. The bourbon finish. I like. Very nice. Great.